Ever wonder how to fight off the energy slump that comes from sitting at your desk all day? Good news, it's possible. Welcome to the invigorating world of Deskercise, a fun and effective way to fight back against the sedentary lifestyle. We all know the feeling. After hours of non-stop work our bodies start to feel sluggish, our focus begins to wane, and our mood swings towards the gloomy side. This, my friends, is the dreaded sitting disease. But fear not, Deskercise is here to the rescue. Imagine turning your workspace into a mini gym, boosting your energy, improving your mood, and combating the negative effects of sitting with simple exercises. Picture yourself doing chair squats, desk push-ups, seated leg lifts, desk stretches, all while cracking a smile and having a good time. No fancy equipment, no large space, just you, your desk, and a dash of enthusiasm. So are you ready to banish those midday slumps and reclaim your vitality? Stay tuned to discover a routine that will have you feeling energized and refreshed right at your desk. Ready to dive into our Deskercise routine? It's time to kiss that sluggish feeling goodbye. First up on our Deskercise menu are chair squats. You may be familiar with squats, but these are a fun twist designed for the office or home workspace. Simply stand in front of your chair, feet hip width apart. Lower yourself down as if you're about to sit, but stop just before you touch the chair, then rise back up. This exercise is great for strengthening your leg muscles and getting your heart rate up. Aim for around five sets of 10 repetitions, but remember, listen to your body and work at your own pace. Next, we're moving on to desk push-ups. No, you don't need to get down on the floor for these. Stand a few steps away from your desk, place your hands on the edge, shoulder width apart. Now, lower your chest towards the desk, keeping your body in a straight line, then push back up. This exercise targets your chest and arm muscles. Again, aim for five sets of 10, but don't push yourself too hard. The goal is to feel invigorated, not exhausted. Now let's add a dash of humor. Imagine your boss walks in while you're doing these exercises. You can just tell them you're taking a stand against the sedentary lifestyle. Or better yet, get them to join in. After all, Deskercise is more fun when you're not doing it alone. Remember, the key to a successful Deskercise routine is consistency. It's not about how many reps you can do in one go, but about making it a regular part of your workday. So even if you can only manage a few reps at first, don't worry, you'll build strength and stamina over time. Feel the burn yet? We're just getting started. So stay tuned, keep that energy high, and get ready to conquer the rest of your day with a spring in your step. Let's continue to fight the desk and embrace the power of movement. Now that you're warmed up, let's keep the momentum going with the next part of our Deskercise routine. Next up, we have the seated leg lifts. This exercise targets your core and lower body, helping to keep those muscles engaged even while you're seated. Start by sitting tall in your chair, keeping your back straight and your feet flat on the floor. Then, one at a time, lift your legs straight out in front of you and hold for a count of 10. Keep your core engaged and try not to lean back in your chair. Repeat this for 10 rounds. You might feel a bit silly doing this in your office, but trust us, your abs will thank you later. Moving on, we have the desk stretches. These are perfect for relieving tension and stiffness after sitting for long periods. First, reach both arms up towards the ceiling, taking a deep breath in as you stretch your body tall. Then, as you exhale, slowly bring your arms down and reach for your toes. Don't worry if you can't touch your toes, just go as far as you can comfortably. Repeat this for five rounds. Another great stretch is the seated twist. With your feet flat on the ground, slowly turn your upper body towards the right, using your desk to help deepen the stretch. Hold for 10 counts, then switch to the other side. This exercise not only stretches your back and shoulders, but also helps to improve your posture and flexibility. Finally, let's do some wrist and finger stretches to combat the strain from typing. Extend one arm out in front of you, palm facing up. With your other hand, gently pull the fingers down towards the floor until you feel a stretch in your forearm. Hold for a count of 10, then switch to the other side. Well done, you're halfway through the routine, keep up the good work. Remember, every little movement counts, so don't be hard on yourself if you can't do all the exercises perfectly. The goal here is to get moving and have fun while doing it. Let's continue to fight the desk together. Feeling invigorated? Let's power through the final part of our Deskercise routine. Let's dive into the last series of exercises designed to give you that final push. Remember, we're not just fighting physical sluggishness here, but also that pesky mental fog that can creep in after hours of sitting. First up, we have the seated bicycle. Imagine you're pedaling a bike while seated in your chair. 
Do this for 30 seconds to get your heart rate up and work those abdominal muscles. Next, let's target the shoulders and upper back with some seated shoulder shrugs and rolls. Lift your shoulders up towards your ears, hold for a few seconds, then roll them back and down. Repeat this 10 times. Let's not forget about our wrists and hands, especially if you're typing all day. Extend one arm out in front of you, then use your other hand to gently pull the fingers back towards your body, stretching your forearm and wrist. Switch hands and repeat. And finally, the grand finale, the chair swivel. This one's a bit of fun. Using your core muscles, lift your feet slightly off the ground and use your hands on your desk to swivel the chair from side to side. Aim for 10 swivels each way. These exercises are not just about boosting your energy, but also about improving your posture, reducing stress, and increasing your overall well-being. The importance of completing the routine cannot be overstated. It's not about how fast you can do them, but about consistency and making them a part of your daily work routine. Remember, every bit of movement counts. It's all about making the most of what you have and where you are. Congratulations, you've completed the desk size routine. How do you feel? Remember, this desk size routine is a tool, a weapon in your arsenal to fight the sedentary lifestyle. Use it, enjoy it, and most importantly, have fun with it. After all, who said fitness couldn't be fun and functional? So put on that victory smile because you've just taken a significant step towards a healthier, happier you. Keep up the good work, and remember, every day is a new opportunity to move, stretch, and grow. You've learned our desk size routine, but do you know why it's so beneficial? Let's rewind a bit. In today's episode, we've taken you through a series of desk-friendly workouts, from chair squats and desk push-ups to seated leg lifts and desk stretches. Each of these exercises has been designed to be fun and effective, targeting your muscles and getting your blood pumping, all while fitting seamlessly into your workday. Now, why is this important? Well, let's dive into the benefits of desk size. First off, it boosts your mood. Yes, you heard that right. The physical activity releases chemicals in your brain, endorphins, that act as natural mood lifters. So, when you're feeling that midday slump, a quick round of desk size can do wonders to uplift your spirits. Secondly, it increases your energy levels. When you engage in physical activity, your heart rate goes up and your body starts to produce more energy. This can help you combat fatigue and feel more alert and focused. So instead of reaching for that third cup of coffee, why not try a few desk push-ups instead? And the cherry on top? Desk size combats the negative effects of sitting. Studies have shown that long periods of sitting can lead to a host of health issues, from back pain to an increased risk of heart disease. By incorporating desk size into your day, you're actively fighting against these risks, promoting better posture, and enhancing your overall health and well-being. And let's not forget the fun factor. Our desk size routine is not just about exercise. It's also about bringing a dash of humor and lightheartedness to your workday. Because who said workouts have to be boring? So there you have it. Desk size is not just a way to move. It's a way to improve your mood, boost your energy, combat the sedentary lifestyle, and have a bit of fun while you're at it. Remember, a little movement can go a long way in fighting the desk. Now that you're equipped with this powerful routine, it's time to put it into practice. Remember, consistency is key. Try to incorporate these exercises into your daily work life. It doesn't have to be all at once, you can spread it out throughout the day. Every little bit counts. You don't need a fancy gym membership or expensive equipment. All you need is your chair, your desk, and your determination. These simple exercises can make a world of difference to your health. They get your blood pumping, your muscles working, and your mood lifting and we're here to support you every step of the way. Follow us on TikTok and Instagram for more empowering content. We'll share tips, tricks, and motivation to keep you moving and shaking. Join us in the fight against the desk and unleash the power of movement. Until next time, keep moving and stay healthy.